This is President Ali Bungu of Gabon before his deposition as a president. This is a man who is incapacitated, a man who is sick. He cannot walk or even talk, and yet he hold on to power until his disposal as a president. Yet the world see nothing wrong with that. This man and his father ruled the people of Gabon for more than five decades and still holding on to power. And yet we say it's democracy. Does a country belong to one family? Is the Bongo family the only white people to rule Gabon? Now, all manner of people coming out to condemn the military takeover. Why? Why is the world full of hypocrisy? Why can't we speak truth to those who are holding on to power in Africa before they coup? Let us criticize those who want to hold on to power till they die and even transition to their, to their children. A country does not belong to one, one family. So let us speak the facts and stop the hypocrisy. The people of Gabon are happy with the military takeover because they think there's a better day ahead of them. So let's rather support them and help them to transition to democracy rather than criticizing them. Let's stop the hypocrisy. Let's stop the hypocrisy. Thank you. Now he's out there saying they should make noise. Make noise. Who should make noise? If you rule well, the people that you rule, your subjects, will make noise for you. Yet your subjects are debilitating and then you are calling on people all over the world to make noise. Nobody is going to make noise and come to your aid. You are gone and you are gone. Thank you.